Yeah, you, you see these white snowflakes? Yeah. That is snow. <sighs> it is very cold. If you get a lot of snow, you can make snow monsters. <sighs> oh, I should have brought my scarf and hat. interrupt this program to bring you a special weather bulletin. So here you can see our snowfall forecast as the pressure comes in over here in the north we'll have one to three inches and down south lower down we may have up to six inches of snowfall. You know there are different myths and ideas and obviously it's up to Hashem how much snowfall there is but is there something are there any secrets that we've learned about how we could make snowfall? How can we make all this happen? Check out these myths. I know how to make it snow. You know what you do? You take three ice cubes and you flush them down the toilet. That's how you make it snow. I have it on good authority that if you sleep with your pajamas on inside out, that we will have a snow day. So that's my suggestion. Wear your pajamas inside out and the next day there'll be snow. Okay, if you put a snowball in the freezer, it's gonna snow. The way to make it snow is to leave ice cubes on your porch overnight. To make it snow, you run around a table five times with ice cubes in your mouth. So we're gonna put snow in the freezer so it'll snow tomorrow. The myth about snow, if you put a spoon under your pillow, the next day you're gonna get a snow. One of the ways to make it snow is by doing a snow dance. Falling on my... All right, boys and girls, you all know this snow dance. Fingers up, heels down. Okay, this is my message to the lower school students. If you practice real hard and do all of these special activities to make it snow, I'm sure it is going to work. It is going to snow over winter break. Let's go!